What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Jackson Carmen, offensive lineman out of Clemson. Um, now, he does play tackle, but I don't like him at tackle. I personally think he'd be a better guard in the NFL. Um, but we'll get into that in a minute. Um, he's 6'5 and 335 pounds, so he's a pretty big dude. Um, and he does have the power to match as well. And he's also got a little bit of athleticism to him. He can um, he can climb to second level pretty well. If you're familiar with my videos, you know what that is. Meaning like, like let's say he's a guard. Um, he's good at helping the guard put a hand on the one tech that he's blocking and then climb up and uh, get his hands on a linebacker to make a lane for the running back. So he's good at things like that. Uh, he can scoop block really well. Um, he works very well with combos, you know, helping the guard or the center, depending on what position he's playing or the tackle, if he actually is playing guard, like I want him to. Um, so he's very good at playing within the offensive line, uh, working with his teammates. Um, he will keep, if he gets you down on the ground, he will make sure he keeps you down. He'll fall on you. He'll keep pushing you back over whatever he has to do. If you fall against this guy, he will keep you down. Um, and he has legitimate power. Like he can, he straight up moves people. Um, so that that's a big part of why I want to put him at guard. But we'll talk about that here in a minute. Um, let's see. I talked about his athleticism. His arm length is pretty good. Like I said, he's six five, and uh, he's got fairly long arms, so his reach is pretty good. That's going to give him an advantage. Um, let's see. For his size, I noticed that his knee bend is pretty damn good. Um, yeah, and those are mostly the positives. Let me get into some of the negatives. And I think a lot of the negatives he has go away if he plays guard. So it's not that big of an issue for me. It's only really an issue at tackle. His feet, I don't like them. I don't like his feet. Um, they look very heavy, which makes sense because he's 6'5 and 335 pounds. But it just looks really unnatural. His hips look a little bit stiff. Um, let's see. His this is a problem that will exist even at even at guard. Uh, his base does get a little bit wide. Typically, you want your base to be parallel with your shoulders. He gets them a little bit wider than that. That is going to make it even harder for you to close gr close ground quickly with your feet. Um, just because it's a longer space to go. Um, and you're not balanced. You're not powerful like that. So overall, I'd like him to work on his base a little bit. Uh, and he also has a tendency to cross his feet. And that's not good either. Because if you're up against a good defensive lineman, you cross your feet. It's going to be easy to just knock you over. Because like I said, your balance is going to be off. Um, but his hands are actually okay. Like they're pretty good about getting inside. Um, like I said, he's got power, um, but his feet and his base are the things that really concern me. And those, those, uh, those traits aren't as big of a deal at guard. They do matter. Uh, your feet need to improve still, and your base does need to improve still. But those, those traits are even more glaring at tackle because you're up against quick twitchy edge rushers where you need to be able to close ground quickly if they're rushing to the outside so you can get your hands on them but inside at guard you're going to be dealing with more powerful um defensive tackles more often than not so and he's very powerful he's very good at dealing with power so he's more suited to deal with a defensive tackle than he is a speedy edge rusher if that makes sense so, as a tackle, uh, if you can fix his feet, maybe he's okay. I don't really like him. At guard, I think he's a guy with a pretty decent floor and a pretty high ceiling. Now, he could be a guy where you start him at guard for a little bit while you work on his feet. Maybe have him lose a little bit of weight if you eventually want him to play tackle. Work on some of those things, and then eventually start him at tackle. But right now, I think he's a guard. And that's not a slight to him. It just is what it is. 
But, uh, yeah, I do think you can plug him in and him start right away. I think he's better than a lot of guards in the NFL. Um, but I just don't like him at tackle too much right now. He could develop into being a good one, but I, mm, I don't like his feet. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.